Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the harvest. So when the last time you come out? When are this, this far? You come, you don't come this far? No, I go up. Up the steps? Go to the cougar and go, go in the pig. So you, you don't... the pig yet? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And sometimes I walk and I go to the wall and go out there and turn back. Yeah. Don't go down. Mm -hmm. Because the place is level, mm -hmm. not stumbling. Mm -hmm. I take my time. Huh? A pumpkin is somewhere about here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's <laughs> <laughs> yes. plant up there and it's bare. You know, a, you see the banana tree? Mm -hmm. I planted a banana there last year and it bears 10 hun. Mm -hmm. 10 hun, you know? Yeah. Can so, what can you see now if you're looking out? What can you see? I just see the, pre the trees. You see the trees? Yeah, man, but they are dark. They're dark. So you see me? Yes, I'm on a red shirt. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see the ground in the cabbage? Yes, they walk, they the road. Yeah. Come yeah, on. Oh. Oh. This I couldn't tell when I come up here. That's coming up here, stumbling like that. No, it don't help. I am very dark, especially when you say I take the olive oil on ninety. Mm -hmm. How oh, far are you going? That's far. Hmm? Yeah. I used to do this journey so much. Uphill, downhill. One day, you know. I remember when I reached right here. Coming down with my bucket on my head after my husband died. Mm -hmm. I was on the water boat. Step down. Coming down. I see a man was coming up. And the man stopped. He did have a boat. Lord, Sister Barnes, good day. I said, good day, sir. Long time I wait for you. I said, for what? I said, I don't have no good for sale. I know people. He said, Lord, I know that. A long time I wait for you. I want you to be married to. I draw back. I <laughs> said, sir. I <laughs> said, from your wife then. Is somebody me know you know? From my wife dead. You don't find nobody where you love. Him say, one woman, him take one woman, but the woman mash him up and Mr. How oh, you know me no go my show? He said, No, sir, a long time me know you and you not go and do that. So me help down the bucket now. And I said, listen, me that's something. You have a bank account <laughs> to take care of me? Him say. Man, 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 head to put. Me say, you know what you do. Turn back and go back down the gate. And look at me say, me pluck yard put up down there. Any what? Pluck yard. Put Pluck, up down there. pluck yard. Pluck yard. Pluck. Say, me a look somebody. Say, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so. Me say, look at me say, man come in and woman come out. Mm-mm. The man sit down. He say, why you so cross? I say, I never send a message to you. Mm. You're not looking for one like me. Mm-mm. <laughs> and the man, he used to pass and wave to me and say hi, sometimes run up all in stop at the house, not again. <laughs> when he my pass here and turn in face over the person, I said yes. Never so the, me. The, I didn't send a message to no, you? No, I didn't send a message to you and now black yard is not at my gate. Mm -hmm. No. Because I have my children, them, and I respect them, and they must respect me. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. my husband died. Mm -hmm. And if you look in the Bible and you're going to read the Bible, mm -hmm. if you're a widow, mm -hmm. there must be a widow in and out. Mm -hmm. Your husband dead, you, everybody knew you was a widow. When night come, you hear pum 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 pum. You hold it up, open door. You shake it. When before the man, you see man come out. Uh uh. uh. No, that's so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm a widow. And God provides for the widow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But if you're going to be a widow outside and not inside, it's going to be something else. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're not a widow. 
Mm-hmm. Use a shadow of a widow. Tell me about your father. My father? He was just... My father never told us, you know. What was his name? Hmm? Stephen Ashley. Where did he live? Mm -hmm. When they came out here, they come to visit me. Oh, I see. Okay, so... Mm-hmm. Let's so, just Let me get all right, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So, why you don't hang down your hand? <laughs> yeah. First time, yeah. first time. <laughs> so, now my sister, all of my sister children, they are Christian. Some is pastor, some is missionary, mm -hmm. and so forth. But you know that your mother is a Christian? Mm -hmm. Okay, she's a revival. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She can see things. Okay. Your mother. Sit right down here. To sit here and I so you are revival too? Yeah. The whole family can sit things? Eh? The whole most family of, can sit the family can sit in because my father was a healer. Tell us about the healing. What did he do? Hmm? What did he do? If you is here and they sit evil on you, him take it off you. Mm -hmm. He come and take it off. And then he will give you advice and all that. And that meeting house that you see down at the level there, mm -hmm. or you call it Kitty Peace, it was his. Yes. So our it, family is Baptist, they used to dress in white and play in tambourines. When they said the bands, what does that mean? What kind of revival, music? Revival. Revi band. What does revival jump, mean? Jump, jump. What does jump revival mean? mean? You revive from dead works. So when you go to the church you now, right, and it started, you Revival that does it kind of cut out now. We're getting kind of cut out revival now. Most of the revival church and turn you know, Presbyterian and all those, but the revival that is the head of society. Revival, revival. When my father was alive, he stayed right here with me sit down here. Yeah? And him see the bands coming from Kingston. Mm -hmm. And he will call his daughter, his name Elnor. He said, Elnor, come go down the camp and set up message down there. A band's leaving Kingston now, reaching here 12 o'clock today. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 12 o'clock look for yeah. the camp. So the people in the truck, what kind of song they used to sing? What's the procession to start the up truck? the revival in yes. the van? Yes, ma'am. So how did it start? What is the... What is the you essence sing. of it? Sing, what like kind of revival. song you singing? You sing revival song. You sing like you know the song would say. So here one a revival song now. Um, I still remember one. Gabriel lose my bond. Gabriel lose my bond. Gabriel lose my bond and let me go. Don't you hear? The clapping of the angels wing. Gabriel lose my band and let me go. And the people in that to shout. Shout right? what? Shout, go round the ring and shout. And you are sound in. And shout. That is revival. You, I, let me tell you. I am the last child for my father. Mm -hmm. And most of my father's um, was a gift mm -hmm. turn over to me. Mm -hmm. When I was around 13 years old, I was at my mother's home. And one Sunday morning, I get up. Sissy was there, that is your grandmother. She was living, it was two, two holes. One this year, one she was there. I have a sister was there by the name of Enid. She died in there. And I took my Bible and I go out. In the, in the barbecue, we have a big barbecue. And I open the Bible. And I, I say, Ine, bring a glass of water to me. You also have those tall pint glass, mm -hmm. but you can look through. I said, put it down there. And after she put it down there, it was there. And I go in the side, inside the house and I lay down. And certain time I get up. And I get up, I take the Bible, and I read, it, read a chapter out of the Bible, read a Psalms or what it is, and I pour out the water. And I said to your mother, I said, Sissy, 11 o'clock, a band will be here. Wake me. 
when the bells start to ring, wake me, and Ben's bands will be coming here going to Kitty Peace. Kevin, I lie down in the house and I doze. 11 o'clock, hear the bell. Sister said, Lena, Lena, get up, get up, the bands are coming. I mean, we could stay there and look around the road and the bands one truck load of revival, you see, Massa. So, where the revival people, drop. where did they come from? Well, let me tell you something. I don't, I can't explain and tell you where this, this, this revival come from, but let me tell you something how revival go now. You go to the church, you're a sinner, go to the church. Go to the revival camp and use there. And a person that revive from dead work is dip, 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 different from a person that just go and you kneel down at the altar and say you get saved. Right? Mm -hmm. You go and you join a church. That's about the revival. You revive. You, you just. Let me tell you how me get my revival conversion. I was in Clarkstone. And one night I went to a meeting, it was a revival meeting. They knocked the drum and then sing and then show. And I was away at the back of the church. And when I find myself, I was just trembling like this. And when I find myself, I was way under the table where the, the lady was reading. And I remember they tied me two foot and now we got. And they put my hand down and I was there just trembling like a leaf. I just trembling. When you, when you, when, when you, Holy Spirit take over on you, you're just trembling like a leaf like this. Just a tremble. Mm -hmm. The Holy Spirit get in you and you are trembling. You, 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 you see things and you do things and mm -hmm. I, I, I went to one after I came here and I went to a prayer meeting one night and when the Holy Spirit take over Three men couldn't hold me. Mm -hmm. It is a strong power. Mm -hmm. Three men, one man was tall like you. Mm -hmm. And when he hold me, he, let, he couldn't hold me. The, it's coming like an earthquake, you know, when earthquake shock. Mm -hmm. so, and for that reason, I was lying down on my back in my mother's home for three long days. Mm -hmm. And my back there. Mm -hmm. Not even a cup of water, I couldn't drink. Now eat a crackers. You see? And the night, the, the that was the Monday night, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, they decided to go prayer meeting for me now and then take me up and when I get up. When I was there, my spirit travel I'm gone. I go to Egypt in my vision, my sleep. And I get three corn dumplings. Three. No meat wasn't on it. And I eat it. I wasn't hungry, I never hungry. They don't give me nothing. They say, me no want nothing, I me no eat nothing. But me say, me no want nothing to eat. When I get up, now them go and keep the prayer on me. Write it for me like that. It just come to me. A big blackboard come. And there was language on the blackboard. And I start to speak the language. And the mother for the church start to interpret it what I'm saying and after that just disappear away from me and a Somalica one come and I said those things I repeat those in language to her and she and after when it comes she say child you got through you is well blessed you get everything I see so right now today I get messages to go out one day I was coming from, how I get, I, when I, I was an evangelist at the church where I was going on Zion. How I get my evangelist? I went to church today. We have a convention. And we have to go home to have something to eat and go back. Kevin, when I reach a part of the road was coming down, it appeared like a heaven opened and I heard a voice say to me. Hear the voice said. There's a question I'm going to ask in church this evening when you return. Do you have the answer? I said, if you give me the answer, I will deliver it. The boy said to me, when you go back to church this evening, you're going to see three men on the rust tomb. And tell me the three men name. You're going to see your pastor and the two rabbis. They were pastor too. This is the question that your pastor is going to ask this question. Who do you say that we three men represent? You must give the answer in full question, the question in full answer. 
you must say that these three men represent the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. There's a reward for you, you are going to receive it. And so the boy said to me, you know, mm -hmm. I don't see nobody. All right, I go home to cook and to eat. I could not light the fire. I was just pausing over this. After we went back to church, three of us went up. When we go back to church, Kevin, the church full from pew to the floor. We couldn't stand up further than the doorway. When me look on the rest of the tree, man, me see up there. Mm -hmm. Just as we enter in and stand up at the particular, Pastor Williams asked the question. They were evangelists, they were missionaries, they were pastors that are down there, nobody. Two person answer. It's not the right answer. I just lift my hand. And when I deliver the message, the pastor, you, you go to, you will go to church, meet, and you hear the pastor say like this, hey, 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 hey in the spirit, in, you know, mm -hmm. sound a message in the spirit. He said, come sister. Mm -hmm. And when we go, I deliver the message. And when we go, he, hear what the pastor said to the congregation. He said, flesh and blood could mm -hmm. not reveal this. This is the power of the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. And the man had deemed me the same Sunday evening for evangelists of the church. Now okay. that is the way the spirit work. Mm -hmm. Now these people nowadays, because me and you live good, I go give evangelists in the church and you know I you know, you know get it. Mm -hmm. Remember when the prophet went to a ninth, who was it, David? Mm -hmm. David, Jesse's son, mm -hmm. you remember it? Mm -hmm. When he have those other son and they come, the spirit speak to him and say, it's not those. She, uh, he asked the question to Jesse, say, have you any other son? He said, yes, the last one is in the field looking after the shepherd, the sheep. Mm -hmm. He said, send for him. When the son was coming in his ragged clothes because a sheep him a look after, the spirit speak from heaven and say to the prophet, that is the one anoint him. It's not by looks, but it's what you can do. He was the one that killed the lion and the bear mm -hmm. and take care of the sheep, prevent them from destroying the sheep. He said, anoint him, he will be the king. Right? That's why when he go and fight Saul, he win, not Saul, Goliath. Remember Goliath's message? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That he killed Goliath, slew Goliath with a little river stone mm -hmm. and take his sword and cut off his neck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's why Saul go after him to kill him. But he could not kill him because he was anointed from God. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. And after Saul see and know say, when he go into the cave, the, 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 the brother was behind the cave there and he came out here. And when, the, when David um, made them say, Master, what must we do him? Kill him? He said, no, touch not God's anointed. To his prophet, no harm. And when he, he said, just get a weakness. What did the weakness was? What the weakness that they get from Saul was to show David, to show Saul. They don't know. Mm -mm -mm -mm. They cut off a little piece of his garment. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. of his gown. And when he was going on the hill, David hold it up and say, look here. Oh, thou king, look forever. Look how could I destroy you. And he said, is that my son, David? And as he go home, he died. He fell on his sword and he did. David get the throne. You see, the, the, the sense and the activity that we mm -hmm. in grab know, mm -hmm. those people never have those ability mm -hmm. to know that this is that, and that is that, and I have this thing now to tell my children. Mm -hmm. They never have, they only go work, work, work. Mm -hmm. you, we hear about slavery. I don't know, my, I don't know, my father and my mother wasn't in slavery. They were re regenerated in the younger part mm -hmm. when slavery abolished, mm -hmm. right? Just like how the slave that was in Jamaica now, you go to places that they can tell you that is the slave build these things. Mm -hmm. Right. So when in Egypt now, Pharaoh have the people them as slaves and he have taskmaster over them. This thing is coming from a long distance, you know. So now did 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 um did they teach anything about Africa 
as far as your knowledge of Africa. Mm -mm. Me you, not any you not get the knowledge of Africa. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So you don't Wait, know. Listen me. Yeah. My nephew now, mm -hmm. Curtis. Yeah. He's in Africa. Mm -hmm. I think he have three churches in Africa mm -hmm. right now. He go there. He minister to the people him. He built house and gave the less fortunate. Mm -hmm. That is still my son. Mm -hmm. So I and him never really sit down, you know, mm -hmm. that he could explain until because we only hear about Africa and we hear that we were generated from Africa mm -hmm. as slave to Jamaica. Mm -hmm. But that is our poor parents, mm -hmm. you know. When I was in Kingston as a young miss growing up, I saw the Rastafari riding, mm -hmm. was saying that they want to go back to their country mm -hmm. in Africa mm -hmm. and the ship is coming such and such a time for them. Mm -hmm. And they used to march and go down to the seaside and say, the ship is coming certain time and all. Now the ship don't reach Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we as young girls now, we also go down and we laugh after them. <laughs> One at a time, we go down at uh, seaside. We go down there and uh, them gather up about them going back to Africa and the ship come and them set up them bands and something. And here we you know, I'm say, the ship delay, the ship delay. For the old light of this light out of the ship so you can't travel. So what what will happen to you now? Come back in a society and stay here. So tell you to get another signal for the every day you hear them attack. If you go to Kingston now and them so so them say the ship. But when I get to find out now, we are really African. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are from Africa. But mm -hmm. it's our poor parents. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see? From Africa, they carry them, come here as slaves and sell them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see, and the taskmaster over them now, when they came to Jamaica, have them, you hear about Kojo, mm -hmm. and you hear about Nani. Um, Nani, and you saw them running down them over, and them, they, but let me tell you something. You see, black people, mm -hmm. they know they know easy to give up. Mm -hmm. Because one of the time when I look on, on the TV and so when they go in and the white people them from England, those were the, the slave driver mm -hmm. and them always, and them sell the people, sell them. Mm -hmm. So them have them now try now to catch them now to kill them. I don't know when they don't kill them go, or to kill them. But when them think they are St. Elizabeth, then they are, uh, call it, uh, God. Man to go be back the country the St. James. St. James. Mm -hmm. So the man say, then can't bother because them they, them tie them out. So then can't bother. So them was call peace. Yeah, the peace call treaty. Peace treaty. To make them go back with them. Mm -hmm. And then the the, the culture dead and nanny dead and all those. But they are our ancestors. Farmer. Yes, right. So we know as who are all the people, you see, hear about, look at them, and the history of us now should go to our children, mm -hmm. so that they can know what we got through. No, when I was young, we have to go and work for the bigger man them, like them a dig yam and so we go, shop and six months to one basket I am, Kevin. Mm -hmm. You carry it over some hill tall on the house. You hear me? You know, I get more than six pounds of one basket. You carry, you carry two baskets, you get one shilling. But when you have the shilling, what five thousand that I can buy now, the shilling could have buy more. You understand me? Mm -hmm. Because things was cheap. You see? And it go on and go on and go on. And let me tell you something. Your, with your dad, your daughter lived. When she reached the years of 30 or so, and the world lost, it's going to be worse. You see? Mm -hmm. It's going to be worse. Because every day, things is getting. But do you have the sensitivity of what going to take place? Why, why they, this man come to Jamaica, give them money to build prison? to take the slaves, the prisoner them from England mm -hmm. to carry come to Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Can that work? No. Eh? Mm -mm. It's a good work? Mm -hmm. Eh? No, no, no. So how, well, the money will them give them? Let me tell you something. Jamaica is on a silver bone. Mm -hmm. Because 
if they take their money to build prison and the prison don't build and when them if they decide to send out those prisoners from England to Jamaica why you why you believe about her? No slavery them I put back Jamaica you know? Hmm? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No slavery them I try to bring back. Yeah. Yeah. So let me tell you something. You lo you left Jamaica from you as a child. Are you go over Jamaica England are you born over there? Who you have in Jamaica? You. You have me in Jamaica. I said the one that leave Jamaica, go to England and burn over there. Who they have in Jamaica? They you? don't have nobody. They don't have nobody. They don't have nobody in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. So when them send them out now, mm -hmm. perhaps 18 and then have do these sentence and they come, they be like prison. When they left prison, where them go? When they left prison, where them go? Which part? Eh? Where? When them send them out and do, they do the sentence in Jamaica, mm -hmm. and when they sentence up if them live, where them go? Yeah. Who them go to? Nobody, they know nobody. Okay. So don't that, don't, the government don't see and sit down and look and see that that is a foolish idea. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. To be taking their money from England. 